Muslim Moors from North Africa invaded the Iberian Peninsula in 711 AD and conquered most of it in about a decade. Only the mountainous region to the extreme north and northwest held out against the conquering forces. From the beginning of the invasion, civilian refugees and soldiers from the south of the peninsula have been moving north to avoid Islamic authority. Some of these Christians had taken refuge in the remote mountains of Asturias in the northwestern part of the Iberian Peninsula. In this mountainous region in the year 718, a local noble named Don Peleo was elected by the local Visigoth tribe to be their leader. He was determined to kick the Muslims out of the northwest mountains of Spain. Peleo recruited his local band of fighters from the refugees from the south and convinced them to fight against the nearby Muslim rulers. He first refused to pay the Jizya tax on non-Muslims and expelled the local Muslim governor soon afterwards. For the next few years, he used hit-and-run tactics to attack the nearby Moorish garrisons and even held the territory against repeated attempts by the Muslims to re-establish local control. He established an independent Christian state, the Kingdom of Asterius, in opposition to the Moorish domination of the Iberian Peninsula and as a stronghold against further Muslim expansion. In 722, a returning Moorish army from their defeat in Toulouse, France, decided to deal with Don Peleo in his rebellion once and for all. Upon hearing of a large Muslim army approaching, Don Peleo and his forces retreated deep into the mountains of Asterius, eventually settling into a narrow valley flanked by mountains. This location was easily defensible due to the impossibility of launching a broad-fronted attack. Peleo might have had as few as 500 lightly trained men against many thousand well-trained soldiers on the Muslim side. The Muslim general, al Kama arrived at the village of Covadonga and sent surrender terms to Don Peleo, who refused to accept them. al Kama ordered his attack and sent his elite troops into the mountain gorge to face Don Peleo and his men. The Asterian defenders fired arrows from both sides of the gorge, inflicting tremendous casualties on the Moorish attackers, who were then pushed back by a sudden counterattack led by Peleo who had been hiding in a cave. As the Moors retreated, they were attacked and slaughtered by the Asturians, whose numbers were suddenly swelled by villagers who saw a chance at victory. Victory at Covadonga and the immediate rout of the retreating Moors secured the independence of the Asturias. This ensured that one small part of Iberia remained under Christian control. The Muslim invaders never again seriously challenged the independence of the Kingdom of Asturias. This victory began the Reconquista of Spain from the Moors, which would last for 770 years. A monument of Don Peleo exists today in Covadonga, the site of his important victory.